Did you know that you could clean out the plaque in your arteries and even reverse heart disease without medication or surgery? Well, here's the medical research to prove it. Hi, I'm Dr. Kristozik, and today I'm going to show you how clogged arteries, the number one killer worldwide, can actually be reversed. Not just slowed down, but reversed. Not by drilling it out with a surgeon's knife. One of the biggest heroes in this story is something most people don't get enough of. That's dietary fiber, special types of fiber. And I'm going to tell you about that today. Dr. Dean Ornish's groundbreaking research at the Preventative Medicine Research Group. Well, he proved that fiber-rich foods along with healthy lifestyle habits can heal your heart and clean out your arteries and even reverse heart disease. Well, Dr. Christose, doesn't conventional medicine say that the only way to clean out the plaque in arteries is to surgically remove the plaque? Well, let me tell you that. There's no natural way they tell you to clean out the plaque from your arteries. Well, Dr. Ornish proved they're wrong. You know, heart disease is still the leading cause of death around the world. And traditionally, doctors have told us the only way, the one-way street is you had uh, plaque in your arteries, if you had plaque buildup, the only way you could slow it down and reverse it is with medications or to drill it out, to drill out the plaque with surgery. But you know, back in the early 1990s, Dr. Ornish challenged that belief. He asked a really bold question. What if we could use food and lifestyle medicine to reverse heart disease? You know, instead of just managing it, we could reverse it. Well, in 1990, Dr. Ornish published the Lifestyle Heart Trial in the Lancet Medical Journal. It was the first clinically controlled study to show that coronary heart disease could not just be stopped, but it could be reversed without drugs or surgery, my friend. Well, he enrolled men and women with advanced heart disease. Half of them were given the usual medical care. The other half were asked to follow what became known as the Ornish Lifestyle Program. It was a low-fat, whole-food, plant-based diet. He used stress management techniques like meditation and prayer. Most importantly was some social support that the people in that group got from each other. And after just one year, the patients in Dr. Orange's program showed something unheard of. The plaque in their arteries began to shrink. They used angiography. And doctors could see blockages in the coronary arteries becoming less severe. And after five years, the improvements were even much greater. So how did this happen? Well, one of the biggest dietary changes in Dr. Ornish's plan was increasing dietary fiber. You know, when you eat whole plant-based foods like beans and oats and vegetables and fruits, you bring in two types of fiber. Water-soluble fiber, which helps to lower LDL cholesterol that's the bad cholesterol, by binding it to bile acids and then removing it from the body. And then it forces your liver to pull cholesterol from your bloodstream to make new bile acids, lowering plaque-forming LDL cholesterol. And then there's insoluble fiber, which helps to regulate blood sugar, reduce inflammation, and feed your gut bacteria, the microbiome. Those beneficial gut bacteria, well, they produce compounds like butyrate that protect blood vessels from damage. Now, fiber just isn't just about digestion. It directly reduces one of the root causes of heart disease. That's high cholesterol and inflammation inside of the arteries. Patients eating high-fiber diets saw LDL cholesterol drop by nearly 40% in Dr. Ornish's program. And which, by the way, is similar results that people get with going on doctor's prescription medication, the statin drugs. Now, in this study, people who followed the fiber-rich diet, the plant-based diet from Dr. Ornish, they had over 8% regression. That's reversal of arterial blockages after five years, compared to 27% worsening in those who stayed on the standard medical care in the standard American diet. Well, folks, that's not just theory, it's proof. Now, pictures of the arteries showed real, measurable reversal of plaque buildup. And remember, this wasn't surgery, it wasn't stents, it wasn't drugs, it was food and lifestyle. Fiber-rich foods, one of the cornerstones of this program. 
Now, here's what we know. Dietary fiber it feeds the good bacteria, which ferment into the a body, it's our gut, and it ferments into what we call short-chain fatty acid. That's SCFAs, like acetate and propionate and butyrate, compounds that send signals to the blood vessels to clean out clogged arteries, and at the same time release renin to lower blood pressure. And we know that high blood pressure is another risk factor for heart disease. Fiber helps clean out arteries by improving cholesterol levels. Water-soluble fibers like oats and barley and beta-glucan and psyllium and pectin and helps the bile acids remove it from the body, nudging the liver to, to pull the LDL cholesterol, the bad cholesterol from the blood. And listen to this. A recent large medical study in the Nutrition Journal back in 2023, well, it involved what's called a meta-analysis of 67 controlled different medical studies, and they found that reductions in total LDL cholesterol with using uh, the soluble fiber, by uh, increasing that soluble fiber, it reduced the cholesterol levels. And the dietary fiber not only lowered cholesterol, but it lowers systolic and diastolic blood pressure with larger benefits in people who had significantly high blood pressure. You know, in comprehensive whole food plant-based programs that are naturally high in fiber, they show that there was a reversal of the clogged arteries once again. By the way, as I mentioned, which in the past it was thought doctors could only drill out the plaque from the arteries. So the bottom line is, Eating a plant-based diet increases the production of a healthy gut microbes, a healthy bacteria, lowering LDL cholesterol, unclogging the blood vessels from plaque, decreasing inflammation, and all the major risk factors for preventing and, yes, even reversing heart disease. So a fiber-rich diet supports cleaner arteries, healthier blood pressure, lower cholesterol, and with a comprehensive lifestyle medicine, can even reverse heart disease. So what does this mean for you? It means heart disease doesn't have to be a death sentence by eating more whole plant-based foods, fiber-rich foods, like fruits and vegetables and beans and lentils and whole grains, and eating fermented foods too as well. You can clean out your arteries. If you already have heart disease, you can actually begin to reverse it. The more fiber you eat from whole plant-based foods, the stronger your heart's defenses becomes. Remember, the body heals itself. Dr. Ornish's works prove that something revolutionary, the fork in your hand at mealtime, can be more powerful than a scalpel on the surgeon's hand. Dietary fiber, part of a whole food plant-based diet lifestyle, can literally clean out your arteries and heal your heart. So the next time you sit down to eat, remember, you're not just filling your stomach you might be scrubbing out the arteries to clean out those clogged arteries and be able to reverse heart disease over time with a healthy lifestyle. I'm Dr. Christosik, and I encourage you to really follow us on social media, on YouTube and Facebook, and listen to my podcast where I have guests like Dr. Dean Ornish and many other world-class, very, very well-known authorities in natural medicine on my podcast. And that's on Friday mornings, and you can get it on all the major platforms for podcasts. So until next time, I encourage you to join our Gut 911 community to get support from each other. So until next time, my friends, ciao for now.